I do data work for a living and there's it's just any humor about that is dark. But I was doing some data analytics for a hospital ICU and I noticed through my analysis that a large portion of their patients died in the same bed at the same time on Sunday mornings. So we had people observing this. And some people were a little superstitious. They had some crosses and rosaries and things there because they're thinking there's something spiritual going on here. But as we're watching at 11 o'clock on Sunday morning, housekeeping walks in, unplugs life support, and plugs in a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> <laughs> and my wife's birthday was last week. She said, nothing would make me happier than a diamond necklace. So I bought her nothing. <laughs> <laughs> the other day I saw, saw a sign that said watch for children I thought fair trade <laughs> my wife said to me the other day if anything ever happens to me I hope you find, find someone new apparently getting stuck in traffic doesn't mean anything <laughs> <laughs> last weekend I visited my childhood home and I asked the current residents there if I could walk through it just because I was feeling nostalgic. They refused and slammed the door in my face. <laughs> Mom and dad are the worst. <laughs> Speaking of family, my grandpa has the heart of a lion and a lifetime ban from the zoo. <laughs> when I hire people, I always tell new hires, don't think of me as a boss. Think of me as a friend, a friend that can fire your ass. <laughs> <laughs> My boss told me to have a good day, so I went home. Ooh. And finally, an inspiring thought. You don't need a parachute to go skydiving. You only need a parachute to go skydiving twice. <laughs>